Hi, in this video, let me show how to use Fluid Pitch along with an MPA synth inside a plugin host called Kushvio Element. I have Element installed in my system. I'm gonna use Ableton 11, but it is the same procedure for every DAW. I'm gonna quickly ins insert Element on the MIDI instrument track. If you are opening element for the first time, you might want to go to the settings and click on the plugin manager and then scan to show your plugins in this menu. I have already done so, so I just closed. I'm going to double click on the plugins, search for fluid pitch and I'm going to drag and drop here. It doesn't matter if it is a VST3 or VST2. Let me insert an MP synth vital. I'm gonna quickly enable the MPE and also set an FX reverb. Cool, I'm just going to connect the MIDI coming from the Ableton to fluid pitch first. From the fluid pitch, it goes to the synthesizer and the synthesizer synthesizes the sound. So the sound should go to the audio output node. This audio output will then output the sound to the Ableton, right? Um, let me play something. Okay, we are in the mono mode, so I'm just going to click the MP upscale mode. Bend range 3, let's see. Okay, cool. So that's how we use Fluid Pitch and an MP synth inside the Element plugin host. If we want to save the states of these two plugins, we can do so. We can just save the project, the DAW project, and the information of these two plugins would be saved along with the plugin host.